The Intel Core i5-14600K runs fast, but also runs hot under heavy loads. Picking the right cooler makes a big difference in temps, noise, and overall performance. In this video, I'll compare the best CPU coolers for the 14600K across every budget and type, from affordable air coolers to premium liquid AIOs, so you can find the perfect match for your build. First, let's start with my suggestions for the best budget coolers to pair with the Intel Core i5-14600K. At this level, there are three coolers that actually make sense. Thermal Rights Peerless Assassin 120SE, Arctic's Freezer 36, and ID Cooling's Frozen A620 Pro SE. Each beats the old single tower starter coolers and stays reasonable on noise once you set a sensible fan curve. The Frozen A620 Pro SE is the surprise. Dual tower, six heat pipes, and noise normalized results that hang with pricier units when you cap RPMs. Arctix Free 36 leans into clean acoustics, tidy cabling, and friendly RAM clearance in tighter mid towers. The Peerless Assassin 120 SE is one of the most popular coolers because it delivers stable dual tower performance without fuss, which matters more than flashy extras when you just need steady boost clocks. So the cooler that makes the most sense in the budget tier is the Thermal Right Peerless Assassin 120 SE. Pick this when you want the least effort, least money path to stable clocks. You get two 120mm fans, six heat pipes, and a mounting that doesn't fight you. In games, you see steady boost behavior without a loud curve. In all core loads, you still have headroom, provided your case airflow is decent. The trade-offs are simple, a plain finish and a shorter warranty than premium brands. If quieter stock behavior is your priority, Arctic Freezer 36 is the low noise alternate. If local pricing swings in its favor, ID Cooling Frozen A620 Pro SE lands in the same performance band when noise matched. If you insist on liquid on a tight budget, Thermal Right Frozen Prism 360 moves a lot of heat for very little money, but long-term durability at that price is the question to consider. Next up is the overall best choices, the sweet spot that most people should target. Here, you're comparing 360mm AIOs that keep temps low and fan speeds lower. Arctic's Liquid Freezer 3 360 ARGB, Corsair's H150i family, and Be Quiet's Light Loop 360 all cool the 14600K well. What you notice day to day is noise at realistic RPMs, how tidy the cabling is, and how much you pay for the last few degrees. Corsair brings the richest software and bright RGB. Be Quiet focuses on refined acoustics and thoughtful hardware. Arctic undercuts everyone on cost while matching or beating them where it matters for this CPU. Sustained boost with a modest fan curve. So the cooler that actually hits the balance most builders want is the Arctic Liquid Freezer 3 360 ARGB. Choose this when you want low temps, low noise, and clean cable management. The radiator is thick, the fans push air efficiently without screaming, and the small VRM fan in the pump housing nudges airflow over the socket so long multi-core runs don't sag clocks. Fan leads root through the sleeved tubes, keeping the socket area clear and improving airflow. On a 14600K, that translates to cool gaming temps and healthy headroom in creator workloads without an aggressive, loud curve. The look is understated and the software footprint is minimal compared to RGB-heavy ecosystems. Great if you prefer simple. If a 360 won't fit, Liquid Freezer 3 240 or 280 keeps the same design DNA in smaller sizes. If you prefer air at this tier, Deepcool AK620 or AK620 Digital trades a couple of degrees for zero pump noise and easy upkeep. Finally, let's look at the premium end, the coolers you choose when you want no compromises. Here, you're deciding between top 360 and 420mm AIOs and the best air towers today. On liquid, Be Quiet Light Loop 360 and Corsair H150i Elite Capilex XT deliver chart-topping thermals with controlled acoustics and polished control options. On air, Thermal Right Royal Praetor 130 shocks with raw numbers that can nip at entry-level level 360mm AIOs, while Noctua NHD15G2 sets the standard for acoustic refinement and mounting ease. All of them keep the 14600K cool under sustained load. 
what changes is noise levels, ecosystem control, and how much you spend for polish. So the premium pick that makes the most sense is the Be Quiet Light Loop 360 or the Corsair H150i Elite Capilex XT. Go Light Loop 360 when low noise and hardware elegance matter most. Reviews show excellent thermals with very controlled noise and helpful touches like an included hub and refill support that simplify long-term ownership. If you live inside IQ for lighting and fan curves, Corsair H150i Elite Capilex XT is the polished route, strong thermals, synchronized RGB, and mature software control. Both cool the 14600K comfortably under heavy workloads and make dialing in a quiet curve simple. Trade-offs are cost and, for Corsair, reliance on software for full functionality. If you want the best air performance, the Thermalright Royal Praetor 130 is the winner, testing shows it competing with entry-level 360mm AIOs while staying relatively compact for a dual tower. If your priority is near-silent behavior, premium finish, and long support, Noctua NHD15 G2 remains the quiet standard. It's tougher to justify purely on performance per dollar, but its acoustic profile and mounting experience are best in class.